After two years of slightly different courses and festivals, here we are finally in July 2022, being able to organize a traditional edition, the 24th Musica Mundi Course and Festival. And what a pleasure that is! Sixty-six young talents and numerous artists in residence arrive from more than 30 different countries. Always a unique moment of gathering and of discovering a new venue and new friends. Some of you, it's absolutely not the first time they're doing the music and all the course. Some of you are students of the school. Welcome day starts with learning to know the building, the schedules, the dining room, meetings of staff and teachers, to be concluded by the traditional all camp meeting. Festival concert presents a legendary pianist for the first time to perform in our program, Grigory Sokolov. What a privilege and honor to have him with us. Bach Concert Hall is packed full and everyone is enthusiastic. starts. Lessons are given daily to the different ensembles and soloists since, as also in the previous two years, a solo program is added next to the traditional chamber music one. Class concerts are the moment when each instrument class gathers in a different venue to play for one another. Yes, a bit of stress is in the air. Very nice music, but play more, more inside. And now for the whole camp photo with, for the first time, the different instruments. One, two, three. 
free. Important moment, the return to our beloved home of the festival, the wonderful Chateau du Lac of Genval. Students, artists and staff are driven by cars, minivans and buses, all eager to listen and enjoy the humoristic Mozart group, without forgetting to go back to our old habit of musical interludes of the students. to the chamber music run-through, a moment in which all the 80 ensembles that have worked during the first and second weeks will perform in front of all the artists that surround us. We're playing music and it's not competition. No, like Bartok said, competitions are for horses. Your first piece starts in the movement, the other part will stay. After all these challenges of class concerts and chamber music run-throughs, we reach the moment of presenting the results, the Young Talents concerts, that are being presented in front of our dear public and in front of numerous TV cameras in order to transmit these concerts on live streaming to the world outside. Use the concert hall as your instrument, like continuation of your violin, cello, viola, piano, harp, etc. Public comes in droves to enjoy these inspiring moments and students give all their heart to do the best they can.
Some moments of peace and quiet are always welcome during these busy two weeks that bring us to the next festival concert, that of our beloved artist in residence. What a delight to listen to our artists perform with so much passion. And immediately after, with the presence of Musique 3 in the hall, another unforgettable concert, given this time by Nobuyuki Tsuji. This blind Japanese pianist enchanted the hall who was spoiled with several encores and a photo session. All these with live streaming concerts of the Musica Mundi young talents that come one after the other to the delight of the public. So, uh, so it's kind of mixed feelings every time in, in this closing ceremony. And I would like to congratulate you all, without any exceptions, for your really hard work. Unbelievable! But it is almost the end of these two weeks, with the touching closing ceremony and the major preparations for the coming gala concert in the Where Else? Chateau du Lac, of course.
apartments, TV crew preparations, students settling in the rooms of the chateau, all under quite a hectic schedule to be concluded with the arrival of the public and the start of the event. What a show!
Leonid and myself wish to dedicate this special piece to the victims of all the past and present conflicts in the world. Oh, so many